Hello, YouTubers. Welcome to another edition of TechSpud. Today, we're going to be unboxing a product called Crispex, an air fryer oven made by Aki Home. I've always been a fan of air fryers ever since I got introduced to New Wave air fryer. And that has since been my favorite. And when Indiegogo introduced Crispex, I just needed to have one to find out how good it is. But first, we need to unbox and find out what it looks like. All right. The grill part or the grill portion of the Crispex. Okay. I guess we'll find out later. Here's another part. The grill X itself, or the, the grill itself, <clears throat> or the air fryer, the dome, and the basket. Okay, and instruction manuals. Okay, so these are what's in the box. We have the glass lid, which is this, and I'm really glad that they put some uh, snippets of the temperature and how long you cook for certain things like french fries and shrimp. And, and state when you want it to do grilling. So we have the air fry basket. And this is supposed to be a two liter basket. Okay. Then we have the air fry pan, which is this one. Okay. Then we have an oil pan. And the main body, which is this one, and you can see Aki Home, does have the time, the temperature, and a choice of air grill or air fry. Okay. And the grill pan, which I showed to you earlier. Well, here are the components of what's inside the box. But before I take it to the kitchen for a dry run, here's a little mini clip of what the advertisers are claiming it could do. seen what crisp X can do I'm going to do a demo and a little bit of a taste test for myself and to be able to give you a rating to see if it actually works I've selected RB's curly fries and I'm a big fan of their curly fries I always have this in the refrigerator the other one that we're going to be testing it with is breaded shrimp. Okay, now this one's a little bit uh, different than your regular one because this is, um, it says stretch shrimp. So they're 
they're stretched, they're, they're long, it's instead of the curly shrimp. I've already pre-washed the lid and, uh, and every component over here. Um, and just in comparison to my new wave air fryer, this is a six liter uh, capacity, while this one is a two liter capacity. And I really love the fact that this is a 360 degree see-through. Okay, the reason why I love it uh, is because whenever I fry something in the new wave, there are times in which I have to pull it out and take a sneak peek just to know if it's ready or not. Uh, well, you know, on the crisp X, you'll actually, you don't need to open it because you can see from the outside if it fits ready or not. Just in, so you don't need, you know, so you don't overcook or undercook. Even though there's, it's air fryer and there's no oil and I'm going to put in the oil, I'm going to still use this uh, oil catcher and it, it just goes like that. Okay. And then this is the air fryer pan. Uh, as compared to the grill, okay, but we're not going to do any grilling today um, Okay, let me put this and it snaps really easy. It kind of turns it on it sensed that you that you put you know something on top of it and Of course this one this one just goes on top Okay, we're gonna do the RBs curly fries. This one here. Okay. It should be enough for me since I'm the only one that's going to be eating. Wait. Okay. Here's the fries inside. Now I'm not gonna follow the instructions from the packaging itself from Arby's um, because I'm going to see uh, and follow the instructions here where it says uh, 400 degrees and about 25 to 30 minutes. All right, so I'm going to put this one on top. Okay, it says, Press when ready, time, temperature, air grill, air fry. We're going to be selecting air fry. Okay, now it's already automatically on 400 degrees, which is good. If you don't, you know, you can make the adjustment if you want. Um, so say for example, the temperature you wanted 396 or 395, you can do so, but we're gonna do it 400. And the time, it's automatic, automatically set at 25, okay, which is good. Um, and, you know, we'll be able to tell, regardless from the outside, how it's doing in the inside. Hence, a 360 degree um, see-through. Okay. All right, and so when you're ready, just, well, when I'm ready, I'm just going to press this one once and I can hear it already. The air from the air fryer. While we wait, as it's cooking, the air fryer uh, user manual does say or does state that You can change the time before or while you are cooking. Just press the time button if you wanted to. And also the temp, you can also change the temperature before or while you're cooking, which is really good. And it does come with a booklet of recipes. Okay. Uh, 
where it says baked apples, coconut, macaroons, they hand cut fries if you wanted to have fries, french fries from scratch, uh, all the way down to fried pickles, bacon wrap, uh, stuffed jalapenos, teriyaki pork skewers. So there's a variety of um, ing um, things that you could do. And so like, for example, this one says Japanese meat meatballs. Um, prep time, 15 minutes, cook time, 12 minutes. And all the instructions that come with it and also the ingredients. Okay. Wow. Tasty chicken. Okay. Baked potatoes. Now I'm gonna try that one next. And fish sticks. As it winds down, if you notice, it displays the temperature and also the time remaining. So it kind of fluctuates, and you know, you know, uh, until when it's and it's done. Now, I'm gonna tell you that. This, the components are actually relatively easy to clean. You just need to hand wash or you can do it in the dishwasher as well. So it's dishwasher safe and you know, obviously you can do a hand wash. Aha, uh -huh. there it is. Let's find out. It looks really good and nice from the outside. It's slightly burned a little. Um, Ooh, the aroma is such so good. I am starving now. Um, okay. Wow, look how moist and relatively cr it's crispy. Um, so we've got to pull them out of here. Okay, there we go. And I'm going to be eating this really soon. Okay, let's see if I can do a little bit of a taste test. Mmm, crunchy. Mmm. Okay, good. Time for the breaded shrimp. Okay, let's open it up. there and we're going to put it like so there's one there's two there's three and put four okay I wouldn't I normally use 400 degrees eight minutes in the new wave over here and then, so I'm just going to do the same here. 400. So we're going to do, again, air fry. Oops, turn it on by pushing this uh, main button. You click on air fry. It's already set to 400. And then it's at the time all the way down to 8 minutes. And see how it fares the same temperature and time between the new wave and the Aki Home Crispex. Turn it on. Eight minutes and 400 degrees. Aha, there we go. Let's take a peek. Mmm. So nice. However, it doesn't look like 408 minutes is enough because it's still kind of soft. So what we're going to do is we're going to add, okay, just a little bit more, like perhaps four minutes. So air fry time. 
it looks like it just needs just a little bit more. Okay. I can hear sizzling inside as it nears our... So, I added four minutes. So that means it's actually 12 minutes at 400 degrees. And let's see how it fared. Okay. Ooh, it is a lot better. Okay, so we're going to put that there. Okay. Put this here. It's golden brown. Okay. And there we go. So they're currently piping hot right now, so I'm not even going to try to taste it. So I'll let it cool off a little bit. Uh, in the meantime, um, here's the french fries. And I do like my french fries with ketchup. And I will have the tempura shrimp with tempura sauce. Okay, this should be ready to go for a taste for a taste test. Um, I do have the temporary sauce over here. Oh, mmm, clean up crunch. It's really good. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Very delicious. Mm. Top it off with mm. really delectable. And I just have to have a sip of the drink here. Mm. Mm. Perfect. Well, there you have it. This is the Crisp X. I would say I grate this mm, four out of four tech spud stars. As always, thank you for joining me and viewing this video. In the meantime, don't forget to press that like button and I've got some dishwashing to do. Thank you.